I think the spice business was always attractive to me because my whole life, from a tiny kid um, to now, um, was the importance of sharing a meal and being in the kitchen with the family. And there's so much you can learn from, from spices, from salt, from the different places that they come from in the world, as well as their health benefits. If you've got a maybe a spice cabinet full of old spices, um, you're not going to know the nuances of mixing those together, for example, to come up with the Cuban adobo or our turf and surf or our curries, which we use the seeds as much as we can and then we grind them and all those aromas just kind of explode. It was a family affair. My dad and I got into the business together to begin with. Uh, our first blend was our Cuban adobo. Um, took a, about a year to, to perfect that blend because it was really, really important to us. And from there we continued to take special care with each of our blends. Some were inspired by our customers, some our family, uh, some local restaurants and chefs as well. We started a cooking uh, video series and a YouTube channel, All Spice Stuff channel, and we're going to start doing more videos uh, linking between the spices that we use, the blends that we create, and the dishes that you can do at home. It saves lots of time and lots of money, truly. Um, because you don't have to worry about putting a tablespoon of this or a teaspoon of that and maybe your blend isn't quite right. Plus we tailor them to each individual customer. So if you get home and you, you say, Anna, I love your all for potatoes, but gosh, I wish it had a little bit more heat or a little bit less pepper, just call me and then we blend it for you specially too.